Welcome inside the pavilion in Oxford, Mississippi, where Ole Miss has just four more games to prepare for SEC play. Williams coming off a game where she is now back in the lineup. Nice shot to get started. You see another offensive rebound, so I think that can be critical. Both coaches talked about how important that was. The Gamecocks keeping it close within two here in the opening quarter. Nice drive to the basket, Snutta Collins. She's not just a three-point shooter anymore. And the bucket goes in, another three-pointer. They are trying to force Jacksonville State to stay outside of the paint. The kick to the corner, the three-point attempt. Well, that's the breakdown on the defensive end. Ole Miss tried to send two players, and you don't have to send two players. Great battle down low. Well, it's hard to go up against Madison Scott, her length, her strength, all of that to create that space to get a better look. Baker, using the screen well, hits the jumper. I'm more impressed with the finish. It's one thing to get to the track, but when you get to the basket and being able to finish. Davis. Good defensive transition, but Collins gets the three to go. High-low pass sets up Ibakwe. Beautiful finish at the rim and the pass from Madison Scott. She's obviously in some pain. Yeah, well, we hope that it's nothing serious. And Snutter Collins steps up, able to knock down another three. And Ole Miss has really taken advantage in that area, out-rebounding Jacksonville State by 18. So this is an opportunity as a team who is going to step up the adversity and nice block right there, Singleton. But she had a couple looks early on that she should have taken, but she didn't. She passed the ball, which is good. And she steps but up she gets right one when there. we're talking about it. Right when we're talking <laughs> about it, she steps up and knocks down a shot. She forces you to change your shot. Three-pointer from Snutta Collins. That's her fourth. So three and double figures for the Rebels as they get the victory today at home. And the win today over Jacksonville State, 12 in a row now against non-conference opponents.